I'm Liz Imperio and I have Carrie Lee with me today and this is for Answers for Dancers and today we are here to uh, talk about Carrie Lee's amazing story. Um, first off, thank you so much Carrie for being a part of this and sharing your experience to other dancers that can really benefit. So let us t talk us through, uh, tell us what, what transpired in this, in this event. Well, I had um, received an audition posting and replied to it, applied to it, and received an, an audition time slot. And then I was going through my Answers for Dancers casting and saw that this same audition was posted on Answers for Dancers, but Grover Dale had written a sort of disclaimer just notifying us that, you know, he wanted to post it because he always believed in supporting opportunities for dancers, but he couldn't stand behind the project because of their method of paying, because they were going to be taking a percentage of the payment from the choreographer to give to the dancers. I wrote an email to the production, the, actually it was the producer who had emailed me giving me the audition time slot, so I wrote to him and I just, you know, felt it was very important to put it in a polite manner and just tell him that the method of payment wasn't something that aligned with my standards for uh, my career or my unions and so I would be not able to show up for my audition. And he wrote back within a couple of hours saying that they had uh, redistributed, rebudgeted, and they were not going to be paying the dancers. Wow. That's, that's amazing. What was going on through your head as you were writing that email? Uh, I think I was, uh, mostly I was just thinking I, I want to come across as confident and I want them to see that I'm not a flaky dancer. I have, uh, I value my talent, I value all the hard work I've done and it's just not right to, uh, to treat a dancer differently than you would in any other business. What did the, how did that make you feel to see how much of a reaction you got from people who you, as dancers, we all look, we, we all look to choreographers, we all look to our agents, we all look to people who really make such great movement mm -hmm. in our industry. How did that feel for you? I was, my mind was exploding. I, I, I would never have thought that these, all of a sudden I was in contact with people that I wouldn't have dreamed of that would be contacting me. And it was just, it was really amazing for one thing, just to hear that they had heard my story and then for them to be supporting me so wholeheartedly was amazing. Thank you so much for Answers for Dancers. Uh, you are an amazing example of what uh, a real professional is in this industry, especially here in LA, and what a great voice for New York. So oh, Thank you so much and I, I appreciate your interest in the story and everybody's interest. It's been mind-blowing. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. All right, guys, thank you so much.